And we are off with tonight's in-conference Loyal Boys High School basketball game between the Loyal Greyhounds and the Gilman Pirates as Loyal wins the tip and Riley on the finish right away to give Loyal the two-point lead. Loyal coming off almost a week of no games, a couple of days of no school for Loyal. Because Sella's shot is no good. Save though. Engel has the ball. Chance Rosemar with the three. Got it. And they give Gilman the first lead of the game. Cameron drives. Going to keep it. Shot. No. Number 44, Nagel with the rebound. Chance is looking. Gives it up. And so on top. Nagel looking underneath for Chance. A matchup with Luke. Fade away too. Nope. Ryan looking up to Elliott. He's going to pull it back out. Cameron finds Jordan. The shot. Good. And holding it on top. Just going to Nagel. Lou almost loses the handle. Gives it up. Two point shot is no good. Number 32 in the attempt. Toger Crick. Luke the drive. The shot. You're going to get down on the ground though. Fall on the ground. So Skabrod picks up his first. Cameron the lob. Drive sh shot. No. Riley the offensive rebound finds Elliott. Eight. And it goes in. Dallas gives it to Kinsella. He's going to drive. Jump stops into the lane. Two pointer, no good. They're going to say it's Gilman. They're going to call a timeout. Loyal's going to call a timeout, I guess. They're going to say the tip out is Loyal's ball. Quick timeout here. 6-3 lead for Loyal. Happy birthday, Mackenzie Love. Happy birthday. And it'll be Gilman Ball, actually. Loyal called the timeout, but it's Gilman Ball coming out of the timeout. Nagel looking. Rosemeyer is going to pull it back out. Find Nagel on the pick and roll the shot. Good. Nagel's got two points. Luke spin move the take. I'm going to say is. I'm going to call it double dribble on the spin move. First turn over there for Loyal. Gilman will bring it up. Dallas Gabram gives it off to Rosemeyer. Skabra out again. Crick is it? It's going to come all around a chance. And Rosemeyer has got two more to add to his total. He's got five points. Got your three. Got it. Comes off the screen, sets his feet, knocks it down. Kirk on the drive. The take into traffic and the finish. Nice finish. Riley looking for a one on one, but he's going to pull it back out. Middle of the lane looking pretty open. Geiger's going to take it. They're going to say foul before the shot. Foul 
Chance Rosemeyer is going to pick up his first foul. Lob Cameron. Shot. Good. That'll give Loyal the lead back. Off the screen, Rosemar. Uh, illegal screen by Nagel. So Riley will bring it up. Just going to keep it. Skips it to Elliott. Ah, uh, lost the handle on it, so the shot goes off the backboard. Dallas looking. Kinsella. Skips across to Crick, who no one's on. And Crick's got four points on the night. Well, is isn't a man, so. No one should really be getting too, uh, too uh, quiet behind him. Uh, Jordan though, on the backside, almost getting the finish, gets behind the defense. Loyal will come out with the rebound. Cameron looking the post. Shot. Cameron Russo, two. Cameron adds two more in his total. Priscilla looking. Shot is good. And Loyal and Gilman just trading punches here. 13 to 13 with 13 minutes to play. Luke the drive, kick. Cameron, gonna go all the way. Nice dish pass, Jordan. It's a nice find. So far it's been back and forth. One more talking here from Loyal. Dallas on the drive, it's, loses it. Elliott gets it. Riley up to Cameron three. Got it. Cameron Cameron's at seven points. In the corner, Rosemeyer, Quinsella. Take, nope, Crick. Crick will get six. She's third basket of the night. back out here. Cameron on the drive by himself. Shot is short. Move the defenders a little too far underneath the rim there to get a charge call, but no body call either, so they'll keep playing. And sell off the screen. The three. No. And they go with the rebound. Schrosmeyer's shot is no good. Riley to Elliott. Luke skips it to Geiger, the three. And he's got it. Loyal two for two for outside the three point line. Chance squared, but didn't shoot. Dallas off the screen. Kicks. Oh, it's got a one on one. He lost the handle on the dish, though. So. Dallas will give it to Rosemeyer. Rosemeyer comes off the screen straight to the rim. The floater goes. And he's got seven on the night. Makes it a four point game. Elliot kicks. Cameron, three, another one. Got it. And Cameron's already over 13 points here tonight. Two for two, Gaia and Elliot with the tip. Gonna get a sub. Sub. Going on the court. So 
And stay not looking. Rose Marlin's going to come off an angle screen. Cameron is hit. He's holding it out on top. And Sella squares, isn't moving. Lobs it to Rosemeyer. Inside an angle on the pass to Crick. Oh, nice back door. That's what you can do with good player movement. And they find a nice cutting lane off of a rough pass. Jordan gets a nice pass from Geiger, though. Ooh, in and out. Nagel the rebound. Jordan finishes on the back end. Nice finish in the steal. Rosemeyer. Ooh. Elliot Winninger. He's looking for a teammate. No one there. It's loyal ball. Cameron the screen. Geiger the three. No. There you go, the rebound. Comes it back out. Crick looking up top to Nagels. Pass is taken away by Jordan Cameron on the drive. Dishes it on the wide open. But Cole, excuse me, Luke off the glass and he makes it a 28 to 19 game. We're gonna get a timeout for Gilman here. Give this player some rest. Coming out of the timeout, Gilman ball, 8.30 to play. And Sailor, Elliot, they're gonna get a travel on Winninger. It's gonna be loyal ball. Guy, you're to bring it up. Cameron and pull up. No. Nagel the rebound. I couldn't say a lot. The screen, they're going to get maybe a moving screen, I think. Yep, Ethan Grunseth. Didn't set his feet. Kind of try to shuffle out of, into place. And it's going to be another turnover here for Gilman. Quino, ooh, had Luke on the back door. I can give it back. Cameron, another three. Got it. Three for Cameron. Cameron, perfect from the. Three point line there, it's three for three. Elliot looking, he's got Crick. Nagel had the seal, but I think they're gonna get a push on Quinn. Take out Elliot, he drives on Geiger, they're gonna get a body call. Foul is called on 
A little too tight on defense. They're going to get him clipping the hip. Second team foul. Oh, you're looking, he kicks out. Nagel spins, kicks back. Kirk off, not off the screen, and there's another foul. Three fouls in a row here. Jordan's going to get called for the reach. Checking in for the Greyhounds is number 21, Elliot Kinsman. 31 19, Moyle needs it. Kinsella. Nope, he's gonna drive. Get step separation. I'm over in the back. And so didn't have anyone to pass, and no one got open. And he just put it up for somebody, and nobody was there. Inbounds here. Gets it to Elliott. Cameron got nice position. Left it short, though. Opportunity there. Missed it. Gotta get the next one here for Loyal. There's two, no good. 34 shot is off. Cameron Quinn with the rebound. Cameron's gonna go to finish. There it is. Cameron having himself a big first half here. And so, he's gonna look underneath an angle. Spin, two pointer. Got it. A little hook there goes for him. Still makes it a 12 point game. Cameron another three. And they're just not, they're not even guarding him. They're leaving him wide open on the, on the line. We're gonna get a timeout here by Gilman. Why well, are going to full court press here? Gilman, Gilman a little bit of trouble. Gilman going to have to draw something up to get out of this. So Loyal and you're start, starting to pull away. 15 point lead now. For a while it was just back to back, punch for punch. Each team getting shots to fall. Cameron over, over 18 points here tonight. It's four for four from the three point line. Leading, sco leading scorer for Gilman is Crick with six points. Or eight, eight, excuse me, eight. And the guys, after a couple of snow days and basically a game a week, will be having about, I believe, three games in uh, just over a span of seven days. Game tonight, they've got... A rescheduled game next week, Monday, a day off. Loyal does not have school that day either. Monday, Loyal be in Columbus for the first match, really, of that, that rivalry. Loyal already on the second round of playing conference, but because of so many cancellations, Loyal's first time with Columbus is all the way here in January, so late January. Loyal out in a new defense here. Giving Gilman something to, new to look at. Chance to two though. And he knocks it down and they find a little bit of a gap there and take advantage of it. Yeah, your kicks. Luke liked the look, but he didn't shoot it. Cameron, how about it? Five? No. Almost five. Five. Elliot. See where they got the foul on. Skabroud, Dallas Skabroud. So Skabroud picks up his second. Cameron left. No one's on him. Left it short though. He's been perfect from outside that three-point line, but he's got two misses here from inside. Having a little bit of trouble in that short-range game there. Nagel gives it off to Rosemeyer, deep three, wow, no. Geiger's trying to after, got it, after a while not shooting too many, he's, Riley's two for three tonight from the three-point line. 
win one on one here. Luke with the steal. Finds Quinn. Travel. Oh, the NSA is good. And they gave him a step and a half because he finished. When they hit the foul on. Skabrod picks up his third foul. That is good. 42 to 23, Loyal leads it. Just shy of a 20 point lead. And Seller the drive up to Skate Road. Three, chance. No. Deep rebound. Skate Road. Shot is no good. Cameron went up for the block. Draws contact, and Dallas will be going to the line. First shot will fall. And both will go. Let's give him up to 25. Four thirty to play. Ooh, ooh. Squared it, stepped into it, didn't quite Pull the trigger though, and Luke will skip it all the way across. Ah, uh, his last. I'm gonna say last touch by Gilman. Cameron has the. Take the shot, no good. Rosemeyer three, got it. Rosemeyer two for three, or two for four, excuse me, from three point. Pulls Gilman with M14. Quinn Pumphick didn't shoot it. Luke, drive. Good. Rosemeyer to Nagel. Nagel out to Dallas. Elliott on the drive. He's going to have to kick it back out. Nagel. He's got Dallas on the three point line. He's not going to give it though. Chance will bring it back out. And Sella takes a shot. No good. He's been held in check pretty much for the whole night here. Waylon has his shot blocked. Last time these two teams met in Gilman, Kinsella had, by the end of the game, had 7 3, so Loyal doing a nice job on him. Keeping him scoreless at first, and the ball is tipped out of bounds. I don't think Mr. Lambert is ready for it. Bounces off him. <laughs> Elliot, all the way across to Quinn. Take. Block. Didn't slide in fast enough. First one falls. Both shots will go for Quinn. Makes it 46 to 28. Loyal leads. 240 to play. Oh. 
Going to Rosemeyer, the drive. Just pulls up to no. Rebound, Nagel, no. First toss is not good. Second toss no good. Gilman's gonna come out with the rebound though. Cancel. Pulls up too. No. Most mine with the tip, they're gonna get it over the back though. So we get free throws here. Whalen shooting. First shot is up and good for Whalen. Second one coming. Second one off the rim. Break with the rebound. And Sala brings it up. Elliot Craig the two, the jumper. Nope. Open look, couldn't get it to go. Quinn back to Geiger Cameron to the corner. Cameron opts not to shoot it. Has his pass taken away by Cancel. Cross over there. Gives it up to Crick. Cancel a three. Shoots. Scores. Went all the way around to Geiger. Minute 30 to play. 16 point game. Cameron looks gonna kick out to Whalen Squares. Nope. Quinn gonna pull it. No. Nagel with the rebound. Minute to play. Kick the Nagel up. Cameron throws it off of Nagel's body. It's gonna stay with Gilman though. Cameron's just trying to save the ball before it went out of bounds. Obviously a veteran play is just kind of a tough spot to throw it at. And Nagel into Crick, the two is good. 50 seconds to play. Loyal leads at 47-33. Quinn's going to pull it away out here. Cameron looking. Nope. Whalen pumped the three. Quinn's going to pull it out looking for something. Pass nearly tipped. Cameron humbled another one. No, not quite. Falls short. So Gilman can hold for the last shot. Elliott instead is going to try a three. Has it blocked. Wayland has his shot blocked. Riley's shot goes over the backboard, so. Gilman's ball at 2.8 left. In the half quarter, in and out. High scoring half for both teams. 47 for Loyal, 33 for Gilman. We'll see if Loyal can tighten up that defense a little bit. Gilman 
See if they can get a couple more stops as well. Hopefully Loyal can keep this lead and stay hot. A little bit of trouble last game coming off a almost a 30 point lead in their game against Owen. So now this game is definitely not over, but we'll see what happens here in the second half and half and here's a halftime hot shot.
going, she's studying physics. And then you tried to find out if the basketball and it doesn't go over the room.
stealing the ball out of bounds to start the second half of play. So Loyal unable to make it. And so a second shot, no good. Um, there was a technical, I believe, called uh, on Loyal for not being able to make it onto the court of play. And I don't know what the rule is before the 30 second mark or before a minute. But Loyal didn't make it out here until the very end of this halftime here. And it, I guess it cost him a couple of free throw shots. He was giving ball anyway coming out of the half. So they didn't lose that. Kinsella 1 or 2 on the technical shots here. And he'll spin, jump shot. No. We got a 2 3. Or 1 2 2 here, actually. Yeah. 1 2 2, a height. Three players and Loyal just kind of keeping it outside, not really looking inside too much right now. Luke, there it is, Riley. He's going to have to kick it back out. It was tipped, but it's going to stay with Loyal. Luke's going to go deep to Elliot. Game will come out, skip. Back to a low 2 3 here for Gillen. Luke drives lane, kicks Cameron the 3. E no. They're going to get over the back. Nice position by Jordan. Good spot for the offensive rebound. It's going to stay with Boyle. Drive by Riley. Shot, it's good. Dallas will come off the screen. Now we're going to get a timeout here from Gilman. After Dallas loses the ball. So it's going to be a first charge timeout for Gilman. They're already down to two. 34-49, Loyal leads a quick timeout here to just relax, get some com composure here for Gilman. Yeah, I, I don't know what the rule is. I I know the technical is for not getting out here in a certain amount of time. I just don't know how early you have to be out here. And I know we were under a minute before Loyal even showed up here. Long halftime talk, I guess. Nagel's shot is rejected and knocked out of bounds. Dallas is looking. He's got five seconds there. He's got to throw it. That's going to be a... They're not going to get the five count. Nagel into contact. No good. Thought they might get it. But just shy of that five second count there. So it's going to stay with Gilman and... Nagel's got a couple of free throws coming. First free throw is good. It's 
Second, no good. Dallas, uh, they're going to get a foul on Dallas. I think that's going to be his third. Fourth. It's going to be Skate Rod's fourth foul. So he's got four just going off the start of his uh, second and a half, 16.40 to play. They're going to leave him in. Well, it was uh, pretty good about it. Last game about attacking the uh, foul trouble players for Owen. Oh, Luke looking inside. Jordan had a nice seal. It was the right look. Just didn't fake him. And Kinsella went right up with the pass. Kinsella spin. The take. No. Rolls off the rim. And she's going to... He's not able to save it before it goes out of bounds. Riley, I'll bring it up. Jordan holds it back out. Ooh. Quinn was hoping Elliott would come up to the top of the key and said he stops. Couple consecutive turnovers here for Loyals. Having trouble pulling some points in here. Quinn jumped in front of it, but it, Elliot on Elliot. <laughs> Here's Dallas on the drive. Elliot with the takeaway. And he's going to get a chance to show his speed a little bit. Ooh, but the layup is no good. A little too hard out on the left hand. Chance to go middle of the lane. Or in court, excuse me. Crick inside Nagel. Take. Short. Taken away by Rosemary, tries a three. No. Couple of turnovers here for Loyal in the last few possessions, and coach not too happy with it, obviously. It's gonna get a timeout here quick in this second half. Three left for Loyal, two for Gilman. Four fouls for Dallas Cabral. Rowden and Gilman's taking in that zone, so it might be a little bit tough to attack him, but loyal has got to find something here to get inside. Geiger with the only shot. Coming out of the second half that went. A little floater. Gilman getting shot attempts, they're just not falling. A couple of threes that didn't go. Some drives in the lane, and they're just not falling. So Gilman's getting what they want. They're getting looks, and really good looks, actually. They're just not getting... Getting them to fall, see if that continues here. Loyal's just got to get shots up. Stop shooting themselves in the foot here. Elliot looks baseline, Jordan. Back to Elliot. Riley holds it on top of the key, looking underneath. He's gonna bring it around to Quinn. Got a corner, guy you're all the way to Cameron in the middle. Followed and the finish. Gonna follow up. Tora Crick with the his first foul. And the shot will go. Crick is gonna drive, give it back to Elliot. Ooh, they get the foul on. And get a reach foul on her body, excuse me, on Elliot. Third 
I want him on the back door, but Gilman didn't see it. Said Rosemary tries the three. It'll be loyal ball. Tipped. It's gonna stay with loyal. Quinn scans on this one two two defense here. Elliott's got it high. Gunman skips. Quinn, three. Nope, looks underneath. Cameron goes up, gets it. Jordan, two. Got it. Osmar looking, and he's got him. Elliott gets behind the defense. Jordan, we knew they are going to get a foul on him when he went to run it off. Three fouls for Jordan tonight. And Elliot's Elliot's first shot no good. Second shot, no good. Crick, nope. Cameron the board. Cameron, quick three. No. Rosemeyer wants to get it ahead. He's not going to, though. Kinsella, three. Got it. Yeah, no one was in his face or even near him. He's a good shot when he gets open like that. Cameron skipped all the way across court. Pass a little low, hard for Nick to shoot off of. Cameron in the lane here. Luke, three, got it. Ooh, off the back of the rim. Oh, he's gonna get his own rebound. Cameron trying it. No. Sella with the rebound. After the hot start by Cameron, he's Missed three consecutive here. And Sal Elliott's going to pick up his fourth. Going in for the reach, and I don't know who Whalen's for, but it might be for him now. Jordan's got three, and now he's coming in, so I got a feeling he's for Elliott. Elliott's going to come in. Or excuse me, Jordan and Whalen's going to come in. So, low pass, Rosemeyer's shot is tipped. Foul, Rosemeyer, and it's a fourth. Two of his. Only his third foul. Four fouls for Gimlin, five for Loyal. Ooh, Riley. Cameron. He finds Cameron. Ryan, uh, no one even near him. Goes up, gets the contact. He'll get two free throw shots. Uh, first one, no good. No go up to this point. It's... Shooting really well from the line when they get there. Second one goes. Trevor. Schmidt beats Quinn off the dribble. He's going to pull it back out here. And Elliot coming off the dribble. The screen, excuse me. Waylon on the help. Trevor's wants to drive, he's gonna keep his dribble. Sella looks. Oh, 
He's gonna hold it on the top. Jordan. Nope. Cameron good. Nice pull up jumper for him. A little trouble on the inside range there, but short range, but he knocks that one down. Crick almost can't quite pull it down though. Geiger too. And that'll make it 59 to 38. Loyal finally getting their lead started. They're getting the run going. Gives himself a 21 point lead. Gotta yeah, put this one away here. They obviously had a little trouble last time they had it, but. Gilman. Weather warning. Just some. Maybe some freezing rain coming in later here tonight. Gonna get a little colder after a couple of warm days. Gilman. Fans and players on a long trip back home. Something to keep an eye on. But Loyal here, nice run, just putting points together on open looks, running the offense really well, even getting a couple of turnovers and finishing. The only one's still having trouble finishing. Whether it be on a drive or a shot in the perimeter, they're just not going down here tonight. Gotta get something going for Gilman if they want to stay in this game. Trevor. He's gonna take it. Cameron, the tip from behind. Trevor only used his right hand. Cameron noticed it and went for a tip right away. Cameron's trapped underneath. Trevor with the takeaway. Now need to pull it back out, couldn't sell him. Trevor, three. No. Uh, I don't know if that was a rebound or no, it was Nagel with the rebound if you call it. Jump ball is going to stay with Gilman if that's what. Gets his crick. Ooh. It's past the Nagel. Taken away by Cameron. Skip. Corn Quinn. No. They're gonna say Quinn shuffled or Cameron, excuse me, shuffled his feet. When he went to square up with the rim and shoot. So now I'm going to get the chance at the three. And Kinsella. Gilman gets across. Kinsella's got ball. Elliot's got to be careful here. I believe he's got four. Number 25 here in. Abe Gunderson. Kinsella go gets. Gets it going up. Shot is in and out. Pass really low down to Jordan. That was a tough pass at Corral. Meyer with the ball. Finds Elliott. Up to Trevor. Gunderson. Oh, off his hands though. Probably looking for Jordan. Didn't really know it was coming to him, so he didn't come to the ball and 
Gilman gets a nice tip. Trevor kicks back out. Rose Myers gonna pull it out here. Scan the defense. He's gotta start making a play here. They don't can't really afford to be pulling it out and sitting around and waiting. Down by 21. Gotta score. Gunderson inside of Crick. Skip. Elliott three. No. Rose Myers the board. He's gonna have to pull it out. He tries three. Nope. Gunderson shot is blocked. Oh, Crick had a nice tip. Thought he was going to be on a one on zero situation. Get that pass, but Jordan corrals it. Wing, kick, Cameron, take, finds Jordan. Nice. Jordan closing in on 10 points tonight. Oh, passes too much for Rosemeyer. Pass tipped and not taken away though. Quinn, three. Got it. Three points for Quinn Russo. Quinn knocks down his first three of the night. Loyal well, playing some nice help defense here. Travel. Give this back to Quinn, he's traveled. A couple of travel calls since the entire game here. It's just kind of players not knowing which one is their pivot foot and just going going on the drive before putting the ball down. It's a pretty common travel call. Anderson, corner, and sell. Rosemeyer, three. And last touch by Elliot Gettemann saves with Gilman. Rosemeyer looking, he's got five. There's the lob. Trevor with the rebound. Or the pass, excuse me. Rosemeyer spin. Up. Oh, got it. Rosemeyer over 18 tonight. Leading score for Gilman. Geiger on the drive. Shot. Or pass. Nice find, Cameron, the finish. Three point basket, Cameron Russo. Cameron adds another three to his toe. Rosemary tries. Off the rim. Corner. Elliott, floater. Offensive foul. Nice thought. Pulls up, tries to shoot over the bigger man, but set his feet, found a nice spot to set up. Outside the lane is a good call. Pass is too much for Kinsella and his loyal ball.
Camry crossover, Luke. Up, Riley squares, three, no. Loyal ball, or excuse me, give him ball. Sixty-seven to forty, Loyal leads it. Loyal more than comfortable lead here, but I think they'd like to get a couple more stops. A few more finishes on the offensive possession. Nagel working with Cameron there on the paint. Cameron goes in for the steal, block from behind. Oh, they're gonna get a foul on Cameron. That put the that put the team in bonus. And selling no, and and the Stevens is kind of getting into his head a little bit. Had a pretty big game the last time they faced each other. Sell a senior this year. Not shooting quite as well tonight here, but still a big part of this team, big part of this offense. You got one more shot coming. Second shot goes. Checking in for Gildas, number 33, Dallas Skate Rock. Round the other take. Cameron the three. Off the rim. Wing going to the rim. Blocked. Luke will pull it out. They got time. He's gonna get fouled. Team six foul for Gilman. Trevor Schmidt called for his first personal. Sixteen foul on Gilman. Timeout is called by Loyal. We're gonna get a timeout for Loyal here. I'm gonna get a quick. Well, I guess it's gonna say full minute break. Loyal gonna draw some stuff up here. 67 41. Let's get Monday off. No school Monday. Yep, and that Monday, then again, will be the remake game of Loyal versus Columbus. That game will be played at Columbus. Same times as usual for a varsity game in the JV game, 5.45 and 7.30. Our records stay here at school, so no school for players. But still have that game. And then tomorrow night is actually the next game played here at Loyal. It's going to be a big game, too. Loyal playing Nielsville. Big conference game. Loyal losing the first time at Nielsville. Needs this win to... Kind of fight their way back into first place here for the conference lead. Riley skips. Cameron, the pass is tipped and off of Cameron's hand. It's going to be Gilman Ball. Corner, pump fake. Trevor, shot. Not good. Cameron will pull it back out. Quinn, another three? No. Dallas on the take. Rosemeyer to the rim, the floater. No. Riley will give it up. Luke holds it back. Corner. Riley to the rim baseline. Uh, no call. Both on the ground. Try to go for the floater. And one set up for the charge. No call. Rose Meyer. No. Followed the shot. Gets the rebound. Ooh. Gunderson isn't able to hold on to the pass. It's taken away by Loyal.
Luke. Gonna drive, looking for Cameron. Jordan with the saved it. With the save. Nice hips across there, but it's gonna be short. Mm. Angle the rebound. Gilman ball. 340 to play. Three. No. And Angle tips it out of bounds. Gonna stay with Gilman. Driver almost has it taken away. No one's got possession there. Up to Waylon, he's gonna take it. Dish, Riley. Riley Geiger with the bucket. Elliot Winninger. Looking for Dallas, kinda stopped his movement there. Gunderson gets the pass. Dallas is gonna bring it back out. Tries to take it on Geiger, uh, no good. Tipped out of bounds by Loyal. So 2.50 to play, Loyal leads it. 69.41. And Jordan. I don't know how many Jordan has, but it's fourth foul. Only four, so hey man, LAD to four. 249 to play. Nagel's gonna get a couple free throws here. Shot is no good. Cameron wanted to push it, he's gonna pull it back out. Elliot kick, Quinn. Nope. His pass tipped. Came in from behind the backboard? No. Let's go, Brown. Only with 47 in the first half. The nice pump fake by Nagel, but the shot is no good. Tips, a nice save by Jordan. Nice back out of bounds. Loyal had 47 points in the first half. And as of right now, with the score being 16-9, Loyal's only scored 22 in the second half, so Gilman really picking it up on defense, making things harder for Loyal. Gilman, though, only had 33 at halftime and now only at 40, or 41. So the offensive input just hasn't been there. Defensively, they did a nice job picking it up in the second half. Only eight points scored here in the second half for Gilman. Free throw, no good. Foul on Waylon Froby. And we're gonna get a bonus situation on the other side now. Waylon Froby's first personal foul, 19 foul on the Great House. Gage Gunderson shot will not fall. Pass a little high for Jordan. It's going to go out of bounds. 158 to play. Luke's going to come in. Anderson, Trevor. Anderson on the drive has it taken away by Lou. Uh, Loyal's gonna grab it though. Elliott winning turn. Trying to apply some pressure. Luke waiting for defense. Gives it up. 2 3 here for 
Gilman kicks Luke. Looking. Skips. Finds Quinn. The drive. The shot. No. Trevor comes off the screen. The shot is good. That'll put him to 10 points in the second half. Schmidt's got a free throw coming. Shot is good. Under a minute to play here. Trevor with the tip. Loses the handle. Taking out by his own player, it's going to go out of bounds. Fifty to play. Quinn crossover in front of him. Wayland we'll pull it out. It's cool pump fake. And it's Wayland open on the perimeter. Quinn take Taylor. Taylor's keeping it. Hips across, has it tipped, and 20 seconds to go. Understand that Ali, it brings it up. Winninger to the rear. Kicks. Trevor pulls it. Eight seconds. Trevor. Kick. Three. Rebound for Gunderson. No good. That'll end it. Yeah, so 69-47, or 44, excuse me, Lee, it, it ends. Got him. Yeah, so 69 points in total here. Loyal such a big game in the first half. Looked like it was going to be an even higher scoring game. It, Gilman really figured it out and come out in a little bit of a different defense, showing different looks. Making Loyal, and Loyal not as hot, I guess, as they started off. Cameron having a little trouble hitting that three-pointer. Still ended up with six, but shot really well as a team. Played great defense in the second half, only giving up ten points, and a nice way to finish this game. Tomorrow night, girls versus Nailsville. 545 JV 715 tune in for a girls varsity game. Till then, thank you for watching and Tamar Kimis to signing off.